Okay, y'all, I got this tri-tip here. You see it's just a little bit over two pounds. Where is that? 2.13 pounds. Yeah, not too much to cut off on the top. But I'm gonna trim down that fat on the bottom. We'll get it all seasoned up and throw on the grill later. Oh yeah. This is how I like to cut it down. If you get it right, it'll pretty much just peel off. Oh yeah. Okay, got the tri-tip all trimmed up. Not too much of the fat, but there is some pretty good marbling inside of this one. We're gonna go with our uh, Uncle Chris's gourmet steak seasoning. This stuff's really good. If y'all haven't tried it, I recommend it. I'll spray it down with some vegetable oil just to get it to, as a binder. We'll see y'all later. Yep. I'm gonna put this seasoning on quite a bit heavier than I normally would, just cause I'm gonna let it sit in the fridge for another hour or so. We'll give it a flipped over and get it all seasoned up. See you later. About time to give this thing a flip. Oh yeah, building a little bit of crust on it. What do y'all think? Oh yeah. Now it's time for that dry tip to finish up off of the direct heat. I'll go ahead and crank it up to about 375. Let it sit up there, probably take about 25 minutes. And then we'll let it rest for about 20 and be good to go. Oh yeah. You guys just don't know. This is gonna be so good. Oh yeah. It's still a little tender. That's all right. We'll finish cooking it up here on the grill. Then we'll tent it in some foil for a little bit. It'll be perfect. Oh yeah. <laughs> Y'all watch this. Oh yeah. Perfect, medium rare. It's that good, y'all. Somebody's gonna say, you need a better knife. Y'all, seriously, check this out. It's that good. <laughs>